All right, guys, here we are, day two of this storm. Uh, it's not much of a storm, but if you watched my last video, you saw that we had to go do a little bit of salting. It's kind of a crazy situation, a uh, last minute call type thing, but here we are. I don't know if you can tell, but yeah, you can see. It's snowing now, so we're out and about. Uh, it's about eight o'clock in the evening right now. We're taking care of some properties. It's Thursday night, so we are gonna head back home here shortly uh, after we take care of these couple get some rest, and then probably do the majority of our work uh, about 3 a.m. to 7 a.m., somewhere, uh, somewhere in that range. So I'm gonna take you guys along with us here to salt these couple of properties. These are a couple of our bigger places. They're actually movie theaters, so they're open until about midnight. So I'm gonna go take care of those now so I can go home, get a decent amount of sleep, and then uh, catch up with you guys, like I said, about 2 or 3 a.m.
right, ladies and gents, we are back. It is 3.38 a.m. And we're at the same place we were at yesterday. Grabbing one ton. Uh, it's not too bad out here today, so. Just going spread a little bit to be uh, more safe than sorry. I don't know what kind of contraption these guys got going on on this truck up here. I guess that's their leaf box. Look at this. That has to be a leaf box. And there is salt going everywhere. Oh my goodness. Holy smokes. Alright, so these guys have a tailgate spreader. They have this big contraption built on the back of their truck that they put a tarp over, and I think they shovel it into the tailgate spreader. What is that? cab view so we're out here knocking them out uh, it's 31 degrees so it's one of those as you can see there's snow on parts of the pavement some of the pavement has nothing so got to do what you got to do make sure to take care of your customers so we're on to the next one I'll catch up with you guys whenever we get over there out here knocking another one out Nick's driving found the sweet spot on the spreader uh, if you're doing like an open lot or a semi open lot about two on the auger and five on the spinner is a pretty good even spread you feel uh, with the vibrator on definitely at least with this salt the vibrator on uh, helps but this one is a material yard right, they sell a turn turn
Alright guys, so that hill you just saw is one of our biggest challenges whenever it comes to ice. Uh, this hill is not so bad when it comes to snow because you can get up there, you get a little bit of traction, but when it comes to ice, uh, it's kind of hard to tell how steep it is here. Nick's coming back down, but this hill is pretty intense. It's definitely a zero tolerance type uh, account because if it gets bad, we simply can't get up there to service this property. So uh, it's a church, so we have to go up this hill to get to the parking lot in the building up top. A lot of times we'll just take care of the hill uh, just to make sure that they can get up there. So that's what we're doing here. He's already back down. We're going to head off to the next place. So like I said guys, that one is zero tolerance and that's kind of one of the ones where you tell them it's a zero tolerance. If they don't want that to be a zero tolerance account or if they say, oh, we only want you to come if it snows over two inches or something like that, walk away because you're going to get in situations where you're not going to be able to get up that hill and you're going to be in trouble. They're going to be mad at you because you didn't service when in reality it's not your fault. It's their fault because it needs to be a zero tolerance account. Situations like that, it's not always the case of course, but in certain situations, definitely ones like that, it is what it is. That's the way it has to be for it to be serviced. So uh, there's a quick tip for you guys that are new in the business. Well, we got the same situation for this lot that we had yesterday. Uh, if you watched yesterday's video, you saw this lot. We were here, everything was wet. We had no ice. Same situation today, so we're going to go ahead and move on. It is supposed to warm up this morning, so I'm not going to worry about hitting this one. Uh, we'll head out. We may do one or two more, uh, but that's probably going to wrap it up for tonight's salting. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, Give it a big thumbs up. Let us know down in the comments what you thought. And uh, I guess we'll see you in the next one unless we are able to go hit one or two more. So we'll see what everything else is looking like, but that may wrap it up for this one. One more site check here, and this one was good to go. I threw a little bit of salt up front by the door. Uh, I'll show you real quick. There's a little bit of snow right there. Get a focus. A little bit of snow right there in front of the door. So I threw a little bit there, but the parking lot is fine. Uh, it is a little bit wet, but it's not slick. And like I said, it's supposed to warm up. So I didn't bother putting any salt down. I didn't charge them for it. And I'm not gonna charge them for what I did there. So one of our good customers just came here to do a site check, took care of that little spot on the front door. And that's all she wrote for this one. See you guys next time.